definition of a dictator may be different than mine, or vice versa. My definition is very simple and objective. Yeah, well, Anyone who will enforce any idea or prejudice by physical force, anyone who initiates the use of force against another human being in that instant is acting like a dictator yeah. and if he establishes that as a political system then that's a dictatorship but I'm the arch en enemy of physical force right. I'm for uh, freedom of the mind and for <coughs> bringing people to your ideas by persuasion would not you, by force could you bring your moral perceptions and principles to a meeting in 1917, 1920, 22 to assassinate the Tsar? Why assassinate him? He fell, you know, by a okay, bloodless but, but revolution. But you don't know that. You, you didn't know that at the time. Well, You're armchair quarterbacking now. I, I'm asking you, in the Dietrich Bonhoeffer sense, could you plot to overthrow a person that you thought was obviously, in your mind, uh, denying civil rights to other pl people? Plot against him, certainly. I always said you should, you have the moral right to retaliate with force if someone imposes force on you. So you're for self-defense? Oh, yes, and but not murder. And th okay, that is a profound difference. But it, when, when the underground uh, people in Germany started meeting and saying, let's knock off Hitler, that's morally acceptable. Oh, totally. 